Okay. Oh, that's another leaf. That's not a puha leaf. Lindsay said, um, where'd you get the puha from? It might be, um, turn off the lights and see if it glows. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, he's well, he's not that bad. No. If he says that. Well, that's what I said to you. I, he's um, he I I brightened up his day. Over here. Now we're rubbing the puha. Rubbing uh, all that. Ah, see what we're doing. Yeah. Because it gets a bit, it's a bit too bitter. You don't rub it. When you rub it, it's, it it tastes like sugar. Yep. You see that? That there is to feed one bloke, me. Oh. What about me? Oh, that's for you. <laughs> oh. oh. That off bit, that's just me thanking the Lord for finding me puha. Ooh, don't want to. Ooh, still got my wedding ring on. You beauty. That's that. Okay, got that. Okay, when do we put that in? Well, the pot. We'll check the pig's head out. Make sure the pig's head. Oh, gee. What's that? Pig's head. They look like pig's balls. <laughs> <laughs> Put the spuds in. What are you doing? Oh. Put the, put the spuds in. Two, oh, oh, just splash me, I think. Two grams of spud just went in. Mm -hmm. Two grams. Two grams of spud. Give it a bit of a stir. Bring it to the boil. Bring it to the boil once. So it boils, in goes the next brew. All quarter brew. You don't have to turn around to see what I was getting because you see it when it comes back. Mm. That is called Kamal Kamal. Mm. Okay? Or, or known as Zucchini. Zucchini in um, Pakia language. No, in Italian. Oh, Italian. Now, look at that. Get that, or oh, I think I might chop it up. So There's a lot in there. There is a lot. Take my shopping bag. What are you going to do with that? Oh, cook up another brew or make merry tea, you know. Can you freeze it? Cook yeah. it and freeze it. Yeah, you can. You can. Right, I'm just going to chop this up so it's easier. That makes it, it means it'll be... Oh gee, it's a snail. Melbourne Storms won last night. Yeah. Yep. Oh look at that. Oh gee, that looks good. That looks good. Right. Get the. Uh, See that stick. Mm, no, I'm just talking about That's a lot. Oh, this is called Mary Spinach. Ooh. Ooh. Could you use that in um, like a spinach pie or something? Pardon? Could you use it in a spinach pie, do you think? Yeah. I haven't tried it, have Well, you can try it. You can use it in a spinach pie, you can use it in a Mary pie. You call it, they don't call it spinach, you call it Mary Pooh pie. Um, ricotta cheese. Ricotta cheese? What's ricotta cheese? Yeah, in spinach pie. No, you've got to change that. That spinach pie is a spinach pie. This one's called a Mary pie. It's totally different. What do you put in that? Well, if you want to put this in, you've got to, you know, you've got to call it by what its name should be. Yeah, but what do you put in that? In your um, pula? No, you do, it's what you put in a spinach pie. Just as it's Got the touch of Mary class to it, you know. Like I said, in fish pie you put in mm -hmm. ricotta cheese and eggs and all that. 
Yeah, okay, so what we'll do is the cottage cheese, we'll, we'll get some cheese, leave it out for a couple of days so it goes rotten, and then we'll put it in. Make it turn it into Maori cheese. So are you saying everything that's no, Maori is No, no, I'm not. I'm saying it's lit, it, it, um, rotten means cure. Uh -huh. You cure the cheese. Oh, yeah. It's, you know, it's just another, it's just a pro proper meaning of rotten. It's mm. cured. You know? Oh, yeah. Everybody thinks cured is cured. But cured mm. actually means rotten. Oh. Mary would do that first day. Okay, we'll, we'll stop filming now. Because right. that's... Um, that actually films good. Oh. But you're still filming, aren't you? Oh. Oh, maybe I was.